it going guys, Sharblox here. Welcome back to another Roblox video. So today's video is going to be all about Roblox avatars, but it's a little bit different than the normal avatar videos. Very recently, Roblox published an article over on their blog page, and today we're talking about types of avatars that players create. I found this kind of interesting because they pretty much revealed the most common types of avatars that people like to make. Now, yeah, I know everyone's avatar is a little bit different. It's impossible for them all to be the same. There are millions of items combinations. Well, unless you use Afro, but let's not talk about that. So yeah, let's have a quick look at this article. And if you see your avatar on this list of common avatars, change it as soon as possible. Nah, I'm just kidding, but let's have a look at it anyway. Right, so Bloxy News tweeted about this, and they said there are an infinite number of ways to create an identity on Roblox. Learn about the diversity of avatars on the platform, including a breakdown by age, gender, and type of avatar in this two-part blog post. Two links we're going to check out. Okay, Okay, let's start off with the first one. All right, here we are. Let's scroll down. Let's see what they're saying here. Avatars and identity in the metaverse part one. What is all of this? My IQ isn't high enough to read all this stuff. Characterizing avatars methodology. Bro, is anyone actually going to read this? It's way too complicated. Okay, this makes sense. So this is the variance of people's avatars. So they gathered a load of pitch black avatars and a load of clear white avatars. And we can see that these ones are kind of similar. Okay, well, not really. I guess these avatars at the top are kind of common. Let's scroll down. Let's see what else they've got. So there you go, another type of common avatar. Yeah, to be honest, I see these types of avatars all the time, especially these ones. Maybe these avatars as well. Yeah, this one looks really common. That's kind of funny, to be honest. I bet, guys, in this video, we can join a game and find someone's avatar, which looks exactly like these. So there you go, some more common avatars. If your avatar looks anything like this, change your ASAP. Nah, I'm just joking, guys. You can have any avatar you want to. What's this? 2D embedding plot? It's like common avatar avatars or avatars which look similar or something. I guess this one right here is proper unique. Let's just scroll down more. Wow, so there's loads of different avatars on here. Yeah, these ones are really common. See what I was saying about Afro? If you were an Afro package, then you can't really customize it that much. Gale avatars, Afro avatars, blocky avatars, default avatars. Yeah, obviously these are very common. But yeah, it's definitely kind of interesting. Dark angels of Roblox? I wouldn't really call that a dark angel. And this one's called Look Over There because they're holding gears or something. They call this this selection of avatars, the black cube. I believe I can fly. Who named these? These names are so random. Identity for your avatar. So you can basically tell if you're a goth, if you're an emo, if you're a nerd, if you're a rogue gangster or something, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, you guys get the idea. Let's have a look at the second page as well. Two parts to this thing. I just don't want to read the text. It's literally like reading something out of a maths or science book. It doesn't sound nice in the video, does it? Oh, this one's about age though. Oh, here you go, guys. This is going to sound like something out of a science book. Age is a substantive but easy place to start. Do older or younger users have different aesthetic preferences? Surprisingly, the answer is largely no. That's interesting actually. So a six-year-old might have a similar avatar to a 19-year-old. That's kind of weird. I don't think a six-year-old would copy my avatar though. What have we got here? Footballers and stuff like that. More common avatars. Yeah, I see these ones all the time. More age stuff. Is there more avatars on here or is it just charts? Oh, loads of more avatars. Blocky avatars, random avatars. All right, this is interesting. Interesting. I think what we're going to have to do is join a game and we can see if we can find someone's avatar on the list, which is like identical to the one shown in these screenshots. I kind of want to play like a common Roblox game that everyone plays. Let's try Natural Disaster Survival. I'm on Natural Disaster Survival, but the game just started. I'll wait for a new game and we can see if any of these avatars appears on the list. Oh my gosh, guys, we found one already. Nah, that's just cheating, isn't it? Of course, these avatars are going to appear on the list. They're like the most common Roblox avatar ever. Wait, a second. These two characters though. Oh, that guy just left which had the um, PC head on. I'll put a screenshot of it on the screen. Yeah, that avatar was definitely on the list. I think maybe this one is as well. Kind of. I'm not too sure. Right guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. They are the most common types of Roblox avatars. Be sure to let me know down below in the comment section if your avatar appeared on this list. I'm pretty sure it might have. Or maybe your avatar looks similar to the ones which are on the list. But yeah, here's a few examples on the screen. And if you guys would like to make a custom avatar for free that looks good. I will link some of my tutorial videos down below in the description. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.